Hey there, Ricardo Bueno here with Diverse Solutions and in today's tutorial I want to walk you through the process of installing and activating DS IDX Press. It's our WordPress plugin that lots of real estate agents use to upload MLS content onto their site. So uh, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to dsidxpress.com, uh, navigate over to the Try It tab, we're going to type in our information, in this case we got name, email, I want to send this to a test account, punch in our phone number, and we want to put in our blog URL. In this case we're going to put it on a test account that I have set up, and we're going to click on try it out. Next thing you should be getting is a welcome email with an API key that you're going to go ahead and install. And here it is, try out DSID Express. Here's your activation code. The activation code that you're looking for, the activation key, as you can see here, step one, get your key, is down below. So we're going to copy that. Control C. You're going to go to your WordPress dashboard. When you log in, you're going to go scroll down to the plugins area, click on Add New. In this case, we're looking for DSID Express. Go ahead and select that, search plugins. You're going to click on Install Now. Okay. Installing the plugin, successfully installed DSID Express version 1.1.18. Go ahead and click on Activate Plugin. And here we have a uh, message. In order to use DSID Express, you need to add your activation key to the DSID Express activation area. Once you've installed and activated the plugin, there's a new panel created down below that says DSID Express. I'm going to click on Activation. And here is where we're going to place our API key. Simply copy, paste and then click on activate plugin for this blog and server. Next thing you should get <laughs> once you click on activate plugin for this blog and server and installing your API key you're going to get a list of diagnostics uh, that say yes or no on a lot of the various issues here one way to double check and troubleshoot uh, what some of these error messages may or may not mean or what some of these er error messages mean is to navigate over to DS or I'm sorry wiki.dsidexpress.com scroll down below and here you'll see a list of items and their error messages and what you can do to proceed to investigate what the problem is um, so once you've installed and activated that plugin everything is marked off as yes you should be all set to go with using DS ID Express on your WordPress blog cover a couple of other things such as using widgets short codes and link structures in our next tutorial thanks again this is Ricardo with diverse solutions